Hey guys, this is Tony Solo from The Natural Lifestyles and emotional connection is something that I've been doing for many, many, many years. And these are my insights that I'm gonna share with you about what I've learned through that process. The first thing that I want you to learn with emotional connection is you can't really emotionally connect with a woman like you want to until you open yourself to being hurt. This is the truth. This is something I had to come to um, recently, like in the past few years, about what it really means to have a true emotional connection. And that is, I, have to, I had to start opening myself to being hurt more and more. Because that's what, that's what happens in the process of you wanting emotional connection with a woman. Is that that is a side effect of if things go bad. That's really what it is. And if you don't plan to be with her forever, that's ultimately gonna happen at some point. If you're thinking about getting into open relationships, if you're thinking about even relationships, the thing that I want you to start to put your mind around is, I must stay open in my heart to it being hurt. And this is, this is something that's very hard for guys to get their head around because they think everything that deals with the heart, they need to just be very, very, Lackadaisical about it, which means from the, and you know, it's an American word. But really, what it really means is that they think they should just not have any art heart at all. They're like, you know what? I just want to give the girl the masculine energy. I want to give the girl the thing of just being present with her, leading her, being able to take her to a better place, being able to give her good sex. All these things are great, but when it really truly comes to you being fulfilled in every single way, as far as like sexually, emotionally, and spiritually, you're gonna have to start engaging your heart more. You're gonna have to start engaging a part of yourself that doesn't wanna be engaged because of past hurt. Opening your heart to hurt is the first level that, I, that I've found in being able to have an emotional connection. So, open yourself in your heart. When you're around girls, be, be, be willing to have a girl stab you in the heart with words. Be willing to, when you're with the girl long term, have her shuck and jive your heart. And the reason why I say this is because when I was in uh, New York City, I was with this girl and she was one of my favorite girls I've ever met. She had like green hair, she had the attitude about life that she was very passionate, but I knew that I wasn't gonna stay in New York long. And at some point, I knew that we were gonna stop talking. And she ended it before I did. And when she ended it, it really shook and jived my heart. My heart was really um, hurting, I would say in a good way, because it allowed me to know that I was raw and real with the girl. But that's what it is to have your heart uh, not be so um, comfortable, really. I wasn't comfortable with her, I wasn't, I wasn't comfortable. I was uh, li living dangerously from my heart with her. And that's something you wanna do when you're with women. Live dangerously from your heart. Another example, I was here, in, I'm here in Melbourne, Australia, and I was talking to this girl, and our connection was amazing. And it still is when, when I see her, I stopped talking to her, but our connection was so amazing when I met her. And I was like, oh man, this, this girl is so great. But her issue was is that every time she gets close to a guy, she pulls away. Every single time that she gets something good, she rejects it. So in the process of her doing that, my heart felt rejected and rejected and rejected. To the point I was just like, I'm willing to walk away and find something better. Because I know this is not healthy for me, so I'm going to walk away and find something that I know that's gonna be more healthy for me. And these two situations, primarily, are things that guys will never engage in. They're like, oh man, just go find another chick. Yes, you can go find another chick, but in the process of finding another chick, are you finding women who like you for you? Are you finding women who you really have an emotional connection with? I mean, really. Not with, that you got to know a little bit. Not that you found out what she liked. I'm talking about when you two are together, you draw space for her to fill it with who she is. She draws space for you at times for you to fill it. That's what true emotional connection is. Two people drawing space from each other for the other one to express. And with this, let's get into emotional connection. With emotional connection, what I want you to understand is this. Be more interested in the girl than she is in you initially. <clears throat> genuinely interested, being genuinely interested in the woman is how you're gonna be able to have an emotional connection with the girl. When guys are there talking to women, I can see a lot of things happening. I see that they're there, they're getting to know the girl, they're asking them questions, but they're not even engaging the level of openness that the girl is at. You must be willing to engage the girl on the level of openness that she's at for you to even have an emotional connection. You know, when you're there and you're genuinely interested in the girl, she can feel that. 
she can feel when you're there with her. She can feel the fact that you really want to get to know her because she's responding to the energy that you're giving her. She's responding to what's behind what you're saying. She's not focused on like the words. The word love means nothing, but when you start expressing it out, when you start expressing the deeper aspects of yourself, that's when the girl can truly start to be drawn to you because women respond to energy, they don't respond to uh, words, they don't. So when I say to a girl, um, I think you, the way you think, I find it to be really, really incredible because not a lot of people think like that. It's different with, with me saying that than me saying, I think the way you think, a lot of people don't, don't sound like that. It's two different energies that I'm using in that moment, so the girl knows that if I'm being truthful or not. Emotional con connection happens when you're genuinely interested. When you're genuinely interested in the woman, she can feel that. She's not feeling it if you're not genuinely interested in her. You will run into problems with, girl, with girls putting up, so to speak, um, barriers of, re of resistance, any kind of resistance in the bedroom, because they don't believe you like them. And I don't want to give into any side rant, but I just want to tell you that. Be genuinely interested in the girl if you really want to have a connection with her. Because for her to be interested in you, she must feel that you're first interested in her. Because imagine, imagine if you walked up to a woman and you was like, hey, um, I imagine if I did this. I was like, hey, you know, I'm a dancer. I, um, I'm somebody who loves, you know, running. I'm somebody who loves working out. I love changing people's life. I just went up to her and I said that. What, how, what would she do with that? She'd be like, okay. Yes. And I'm like, so what else do you want to know about me? That's not the way that you walk up. That is not the way that you go up to women. That is the uh, frame of, I'm going up to the woman, I'm trying to get her interested in me. No, when you go up to women, allow yourself to only be interested in her until you can sense that she's open enough but she's going to start engaging back because it won't happen. There are some girls who will, at the beginning, be open right away and give you something, but at other times they won't. So when you walk up to a girl, you walk up to her and you're really there with her. You're really trying to see what she's like. You're really trying to see what she really likes to do. You're not just saying, what do you like to do? You really want to know. Why would you ever ask a girl, what would you like to do? What are you passionate about? Uh, what would you do if this is your last day to live if you really didn't want to know? I'm very passionate about this topic because guys have this idea that you're going to walk up to women and you're going to get to know them as a part of the process. No, you're getting to know them because you genuinely want to get to know them. You're not doing it so you can just get to the sex. You're doing it because you're really there with her. And if you're really there with her, a lot of times the sex is almost, it almost comes as a part of it because you're so there with her that she knows that this guy is really into me. That is the difference. And when you're doing that, you allow the girl to open more to herself around you. And when she's opening more to herself around you, she starts to formulate that when I'm in this man's presence, I open more. That's what you want. You don't want any woman in your life to just be there if she's not going to open more around you. She's opening more when she's with you as a part of you being present with her. Emotional co connection happens, like I said again, when two people draw space on each other, one fills it with expression or the other one doesn't. That's when it really, really happens. Try this the next time you go out there. The next girl that you see, I want you to try this. Walk up to her, and she's the only woman that matters in that moment. She's the only woman in the world that matters. This is how you start to really draw femininity out of, out of a woman. This is why you really start to draw a woman's heart to the surface, is that you put all your attention and all your awareness on her. I always say this to guys, total presence is the most attractive thing to a woman because you allow her to give you every single flavor that you uh, want. You allow her to express every single part of herself that she really wants to in your presence. You're giving her a chance to open more to herself, not to you, to herself. Emotional connection happens with this. When you see the next girl, try that and see what happens. Comment below on the videos so I know what it was like. But to leave you with one last note, if there's one thing that you can take from this video, it's this. Walk up to the next woman you see and focus on just being genuinely interested in whatever it is that you ask about her. Be so interested in it that you forget to talk about yourself. That's how you know you're interested. If you forget to talk about yourself, that's how you really know. You're not doing it from a place of, oh, I didn't talk about myself. You're doing it from a place of, I'm so interested in you that me don't matter right now. You matter.
And that is what a woman really loves. She does. Subscribe below to Essence and Solo. And until next time, go out there and have a true emotional connection with the next woman you talk to.